heck of a way to travel. Alright everybody, we're in uh, chapter 6 now for Science of Evil, which is the final chapter, so this should be the finale. Um, like I said in some of the previous parts, I am going to make a separate video that just locates all the artifacts. Uh, I know it's not like a super popular game, there probably won't be too many people that see it, but there's not really one out there other than written guides. I think they're used to, I, there's a lot of them where you have to watch a whole playthrough just to find the artifacts, which I am locating them in my own playthrough as well, but I'm just going to make a separate video just for the artifacts. Um, and then we might run through Injustice 2, like a tower uh, with Hellboy on there and get his ending before we play Web of Word as well because I'm, I'm kind of just playing through everything that had Hellboy in it. But yeah, I think we've got four more artifacts left. Uh, I don't think we have to backtrack for any of them, so i got to keep an eye out for those. Lore is automatically given. Um, but yeah, we, uh, we just got done with a flashback mission again in Chapter 5, but we washed up on shore here after we got out of that weird underground system. Now we're at Castle Von Klempt, which is that one Nazi dude we knocked into that abyss. Actually, one of his own gorillas did. So I think we're ready to just continue here. Oops, our jacket's gone now. I just wanted to call up and say that this automated report recorder setup is dumb. That, and I'm standing on some ugly archipelago in the middle of who knows where, probably Moldavia. But I blacked out for a while, so it could be Albuquerque. If it helps, there's a castle, and what looks like the result of an out-crazying competition between a plumber and a bridge builder. Looks like somebody's home, so I guess I'll... We shall feed decrepit zombies are molesting the radio again! If I wanted errant frequencies to disrupt the emergent field, I'd do it myself! You gotta be kidding me. On Clump's lair, this is one of the lores. Which basically confirms where we are. Guess we just go this way. Do I even have crystal bullets? Oh no, it just gave me the ignite rounds back, okay. So the crystal bolts are specific to chapter 5, which makes sense. This is man, where the hell are we? Oh great, statues of these things. There's Herman. Hey, this is that's actually the statue from Japan. I can't even see. It's too close to the wall. is more durable than those alien swords we were using in chapter 5. Um, I was going to say, I take it I can't go this way. That works. Or does it? Alright, never mind. I guess we're not going the elevator way. Okay, no context for this. But I guess that's how we turn that off. 
Green gas tank. Is that an artifact? Is that lore? No, that was an artifact. Guess we can get that earlier or later. Is uh the written guide I'm looking at labels it much later in the level. Word. Why Jesus Christ, that was way past the targeting. Look at how many dots we have now for energy. Can I've I got one work? of those creatures. Still not stunned. I actually don't want that. I just have to lock onto the furthest person away. Are those salt rounds? Crap. Uh oh, mini gun gorilla. We have another artifact coming up soon. Thanks, camera switch. Oh, dude, these camera switches. Next artifact should be right over here. Go black oni mask. Damn it, he's starting to do some damage to us. Where did these things actually hurt these guys? So great, how does that help me? One of them just fell. Am I supposed to do something in here? He 
we just keep moving then. You can still hear that gorilla shooting at us. A lot of mice. And a dead end. Anything hidden in here? So we're heading towards another artifact, but I don't think it's in here. Nothing over here. Oh, here we go. Frog worm specimen. It's actually our third artifact already, so we only have one more. This explosive ammo again? There's a gorilla above us. Well, that actually adds radius to it. If you fully charge that. Whoa, what the hell was that? Whoa, I, I only hit right trigger once. I need him for health, but now he's stuck. Come on, buddy. Oh, wow, he might actually... Is he not able to move? Well, I guess we're not getting health off him. He's stuck in the wall. Why can't I grab any of them, man? Yeah, I can't grab any of them. Oh, hopefully it just heals me then. Sucks being you. And you? Hey, no need for that. And here I was gonna help you. Just destroy this wretched place. First, there's a certain someone I gotta pay a visit to. But all things considered, this could be your lucky day. It might take me a while to find him in this maze. Not a maze, a zoo. Always and forever. Empty for centuries, but still. The thing remains itself, even empty. Even hidden. Yeah. And when they found this place, they made it more a zoo than it ever was. Filled it with horrors of faraway lands, the awful spoils and lunatic tools of empire tried to turn it all to their terrible will. <sighs> Nazis. Like those who built this place, they ultimately failed. And for a while, I was alone. But not forever. Not too long ago, one of them returned. With him, he brought these sand-filled husks. And one by one, he made them do what they always have. Yeah, with fancy new clothes, too. Again, they bring their foulness here from the outside world. Seek to bend it to their will. Again, they will fail. But this time, I fear to see it. 
I'll see what I can do. All right, here's our last piece of lore. Oh, what did I just pick up? I, uh, did, did, it did not just do this again. I hate these stupid little ammo crates, man. I always get stuck inside of them. Damn it. It's gonna make me restart. Hopefully that was a checkpoint. Alright, I'm back. The checkpoint was not here. It was when I got into the room, so I had to fight everybody again and watch the cutscene, because it's one of the few unskippable cutscenes in the game, but we're ready to continue again. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go next. Wait a second, I just saw it. So in the room where we talked to that skeleton, there's a lever right here. Ugly alert! That opens up that gate. What will even do to people? Oh wow, that messes them up. I wonder why they don't give you that many of it. Supposed to beat him? Guess so. Jesus Christ. He just explodes. things. Oh, we get some flame ammo in here? Oh, here's the ape spine. I remember there's an achievement for defeating enemies with this. 25 in total, I think. Yeah, the weapon kill achievements in this game were kind of annoying because weapons do not last long at all. This is a dead end. Guess we could have gotten one of those tank artifacts from here too. Here's another ape spine. Oh, come on, man. What the hell was that? Something just flies out in front of me and hits the projectile out of the air. Oh. 
wonder who's blowing this place up. I didn't really do anything that would cause that. Oh great, those one creatures escaped. So place is on under chaos right now. Eggs actually messed that one up. Is that one burned to death? getting shot here. too close to the wall? Yeah, guess so. They always land in the perfect spots. Keep giving me explosive ammo. It's over here then. Oh, just another gate. Where the hell are we going? Jesus. Oh, they don't fall in? That one did. Why did, why did he just shoot? Not what I intended. He went down. I wasn't sure if I could break that.
Jesus. Not good. Just get one at a time. That's not what I wanted. Let's get rid of this guy. Finally caught a glimpse of Herman. Hadn't seen him in a while. Oh, Jesus Christ, man. Are those all big ones? No, okay, thank God. Oh, there's like a shit ton of gorillas. Do I actually need to kill them? I don't even know if I can kill these guys. They're just normal means, like. I think I need to get a finisher on him. Oh, that one died. Jesus Christ, get into a blinking stance here, bud. Done. How am I gonna stun the gorilla? All right, they're all dead. They're even dying when they fall in there. It doesn't sound like I can hear them dying. Really with this? Come on, man. How come I can't grab this one? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> that one's just invincible, I guess. There we go. I just wanted health back. God damn it. I didn't know if they kept respawning or not. That's why I was just trying to get over here. But it looks like we have to kill them.
Great, more of them. God damn it, dude. Their slaps have such a huge radius. Oh god, we're stuck in this reloading shit. No! Why did he auto lock nothing? I can get an egg from it. Man, how many more of these guys are there? Anything behind me? Oh, yeah, drop. Christ, man, I already broke like it. Got a fan, Red. Is he stuck over there? Is this the gorilla we fought back in Japan 25 years ago? Damn it. Of course, I lost my opportunity there. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is definitely not the same one. I don't remember him doing that. Well, actually, he did, no, he did actually have this. Yeah, this has to be the same one. God damn it. Not this time, buddy. Well, it was definitely the same type of these. Oh, didn't want that one. What the hell was that? Art. Okay, a lot of poisonous gas. There's so many different paths. Okay, so I'm gonna have to find a way to turn this off. Oh, there we go. There's a lever right here. It's really hard to find these. Kind of blend in.
another gas tank. I'm gonna have to put this down though. That two hit combo actually does stun them. You just have to wait until they're actually in stun stance. See, it looks like I can, it looked like the same effect when you can punch a hole into something. Watch it. Boom. I should probably should have just left that guy there. He probably would have died. I noticed they die automatically when they get stuck. Castle is massive. I'll oh, raid another gorilla. Crap. Nope, that did not stun him. Oh shit! This is actually where our last artifact's gonna be. There we go. That's the final artifact. You actually unlock some concept art for that, so I'll probably scroll through those. When we're done here. Why am I hearing creatures jumping all over the place? Alright, where did you get to, Herman? That's so weird way to ride this elevator. <laughs> all of our energy circles now. God damn it, Hellboy, stop missing. 
I wonder if I can get another one of those bullets from these guys. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to grab. There we go. This might come in handy. You are too late. Punctuality's never been my strong suit. Too late to stop me. But just in time to witness the birth of a new order. The glorious fusion of technology, thaumaturgy, and loyal beast. A gateway to another world. I ought to get hazard paid just for listening to you, Yamaran. Now shut up and get ready for yet another ass-kicking. Ridiculous creature! I've never been more ready. Are you? Great. Oh no, it's like one of those squid things we fought in Chapter 5 mixed with a gorilla. No, why did you shoot the barrel, you dipshit? Wow, that was a good grab. Good job, Hellboy. It's a good thing I did that, and now I'm stuck. Why is it telling me to grab? God damn it. Take it, I have to grab him from behind, but he was up against the wall. We got one hit in before he threw us off. Oh, damn it, Herman. I can't switch my ammo type. There we go. What the hell? There's the explosive ammo. So I wish you could pick up multiple bullets at once. Why would they put the ammo here, though? It's like perfectly off-screen, almost. Now we're out here. Oh, oh, please don't have these things beating me up at the same time. I don't see any ammo types anywhere. 
shit. Guess we're throwing shit at him. Not seem to be working. All right, we got one punch in. I was wondering why Hermit wasn't just a head in a tank at first. I thought this was like a different take on him, but no, he still is. Oh shit. Few hits in there. Oh, great. Now I gotta deal with him and these guys. I'm trying. Wait, now we're. Okay, no context again. Grab him where? It's not from the front or the back now. That's perfect, perfectly in the way. Thank God I jumped. Move. What? I don't even know what's happening now. I just spawned in getting instantly grabbed. Did we shoot Herman or not? What is happening, dude? not have like any other ammo types. Did we 
Come on, man. Become weak. I can't throw him. It actually won't let me throw him. I guess that is technically the end. I mean, there are, uh, there was supposed to be chapters 7 and 8, but those were the unreleased DLC. Let's see what happens when I hit ready, though. Yeah, there we go. There's the credits. So, yeah, that's Hellboy the Science of Evil. Uh, I mean, it's technically a movie licensed game. I think it came out around the same time the Golden Army came out, which was Hellboy 2. So it was kind of one of those games, similar to how other superhero games work, where every time a movie was coming out, they had to make a game for it. Um, you can see it was kind of rushed together to some extent. It's it's entertaining. It's kind of fun if you're a Hellboy fan. Some levels are a bit tedious, though. There's nothing too special about the game. Like It's a very middle-of-the-road game. A lot of people considered it a pretty bad game, so... Like I said, I think it's uh, if you have a Hellboy bias, you might find some enjoyment out of it, but it's just it's just pretty basic uh we are gonna check out the concept art section now that we collected all the artifacts but yeah the story kind of jumps all over the place it's hard to tell what's going on the gist of it is herman was creating a monster and everything that we were experiencing in the flashbacks was just somehow connected to his master plan they just don't do the best job of explaining that or really telling the story but yeah it's just fun to run around his hellboy and beat the hell out of monsters and demons but uh like i said before i'm probably gonna make a separate video guide on just the artifacts so keep an eye out for that if if anyone's even interested in that and then we also might do a quick uh look back at how he was in injustice 2 with uh doing like a tower run with him and then we're gonna be playing hellboy web of word and then after that who knows haven't really made any plans for another game series that I'm going to be running through yet, so I'm going to have to make that decision at some point when we're playing through Web of Word. But yeah, let's just uh, get out of the credits and check out the concept art. The This version also has a behind the scenes you unlock after finishing chapter 6. Yeah, we get comic cover, which it's only one. Character concept. These are, well, they, they do show up in the game, but you can only see Liz or Abe in co-op mode. There's the final boss. Damn witch. That loops all the way around, and we've got some environment arts. It's funny because this game really does remind me of like one of those PS2 era action adventure platformer type games. It plays very similar to it, but there we go, that's all the concept art, and that's a wrap on this game. So yeah, uh, it was fun. Not the greatest, but still fun, especially if you're a Hellboy fan, like I said. But that's going to be it for this one. So, like I said, we're either going to jump to Injustice 2 and just do a quick look back. That won't be a very long video. It's just basically going through Hellboy's history and gaming. And then and then we're on Hellboy Web of Word, which just came out in 2023. So it's actually pretty new. 
Uh, it was made from a smaller studio, but uh, the one thing that's kind of interesting is Lance Reddick is actually the voice of Hellboy in that game, so that must have been one of the last things he did before he passed away, so I'm actually excited to hear him in that game. But yeah, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next game.